Peace. This is a Meat Potato Sushi production starring myself, the Warrior Alchemist. And today's topic for the Occult family is a Santo Morte card for the day. How you doing, family? This is a card for you today and on this October the 2nd. So hopefully it resonates with you. And if you want your own personal reading from me, whether it be psychic, akashic, or tarot, you can email me for more details at wateralchemist777 at gmail.com but with no further ado let's get into it so i will be using the santa morte deck of course to give you this and we'll quick tutorial when you want to get your deck you clean it like that you go away you don't let nobody touch it so that's how you do that but let's see what this card is. So, concentrate, of course. And what is it? Now, what's the message? Because this is not only coming from Santa Morte, the bony lady. This is also coming from the other side as it pertains to your guides. So, what do the deceased want you to know? This is the Seven of Swords. And of course, seven is one of my favorite numbers without any you know, doubt. Eleven and seven are my favorite numbers along with 33. So basically, what is this card saying? Basically, a lot of you are still in crisis mode. It's still some things you're struggling with, but there's light at the end of the tunnel. Here's why I say this. The reason that I say this is because you're starting to have a renewed sense of trust a lot of you have trust issues so what this card is saying is that you're starting to break that barrier now and it's happening at the most pertinent time this is how it works so basically what do the advice of the dead want to give you I'm so glad you asked look around you and realize that nothing can block your road anymore. Therefore, persevere and concentrate all your energies without sparing yourself. Many of you have talents that now is the opportunity to utilize. And let me take this one step further. With this renewed sense of purpose, as well as trust, not only is this gonna open up more opportunities, but it's going to get you away from worrying about the distractions and the gossip and the nonsense and the needless debates. So it's very important that you know these things. So that's something that, OK, you're getting out the crisis thing. You, you stop having all these thoughts inside your head. So this is your time. Rise. Trust me, I know. This has helped me a lot. And here's someone I want to thank. The bony lady herself. So, with that, that is your meat and potatoes sorcery for the day. I am the Water Alchemist. Be water, my friends. Peace.